Hilly have been supporting Wessex Cancer Trust for the past two years, uh, but this year we decided we wanted to do something a bit different and special. So we've decided to do a garden makeover for one of Wessex Cancer Trust's clients. We are the Burrells and we live in Fair Oak in Hampshire. So we moved here five years ago. It's our first home and we wanted to make it into a really family friendly environment. Um, the, we had grand plans for the house and the garden, but then two and a half years ago Sebastian came along and our priorities had to change and we ran out of time. Seb is um, a wonderful um, little boy, um, he's very chatty, he loves being outside, loves playing in the garden, he's our super Seb, isn't he? At five months old, uh, Seb was looking out the window and his right eye started to drift outwards. Within sort of a four month journey, took us to a diagnosis of a squint, but then we found out at a later appointment the retina was detaching and that led us to Royal London Hospital where he received the diagnosis of bilateral retinoblastoma where he has a tumour um, and he has a tumour in each eye. So he's actually lost the vision in, in his right eye. Seb um, has been receiving treatment for about a year in and out of different hospitals. It's had quite an impact on our life. We, we pretty much put life on hold until we could get him well and, and in the clear. Yeah, the psychological impact of having a child with um, cancer is phenomenal, really. Um, uh, you know, seeing him hooked up to different chemotherapy drugs or fluids or antibiotics. So he was sick constantly. When you're going through it, you you manage, you find the street, you find an inner strength and you you find a way through but at the end when it's all done it all, and he's stable that's when it hit, it hit us that actually wow we've been through a lot and that's where Wessex Cancer Trust came in it was a perfect opportunity for us to talk about what we've been through. Our main purpose is to make sure that anybody who's affected by cancer has somewhere to go and it's that simple, somewhere to go that's close to home where people will listen and not judge and will support them. We have six cancer support centres embedded in local communities and anybody can walk in off the street or they might be sent by their doctor and we offer free counselling, complementary therapies, support groups, things like exercise, um, loads and loads of peer support and trained listening and support for families. Without Wessex Cancer Trust I don't think I'd be feeling so positive as I am now and I don't think I'd be back, I've, been, I've gone back to work and managed work as quickly as I did after um, our experiences. Um, I think they've you know, strengthened us as a family um, just so because we've got, had those opportunities to talk about what we've been through. When we found out about the garden makeover, we were surprised that we'd been nominated and completely overwhelmed when it actually turned out that we'd been chosen. Oh, I can't wait to see the finished garden. Um, it's just, just going to be overwhelming. So excited. We have over 100 volunteers coming this summer to do this for them and we're really excited and hope this makes a brilliant difference to their garden.